Hi, and welcome to Stitch Fix number 23 for me. From the looks of this, you know that I've got a pair of shoes. I did peek online. I love everything that's in the box. I am super excited to share this with you. Can you say cashmere sweater? Just stick around and let's check this box out together. And just a quick outfit of the day before we get into trying on my new stitch fix so excited I can't wait to try them on so to start with again today Saturday I went into work for about five hours I was the only one that was going to be in today so just a nice super super casual day but of course even on casual days Nancy likes to sparkle so um, again I've got my touchstone crystal by Swarovski on this one is the denim medallion necklace this one was it's got some blue crystals in it this was actually ones that my subscribers picked out to me that I bought uh, through their voting so very happy with this this one I've got quite a bit of use out of it goes really nice when I wear blue jeans the earrings that I have on also touched on crystal by Swarovski there's these hoops that have the crystal all the way around these are called the hoopla earrings just loving those uh, put on a brown wrap bracelet today this one is actually called coconut so we've got some different colored crystals on there this ring that I'm wearing I'm not sure if it's going to focus is actually from Home Shopping Network. This is uh, Heidi Douse. It's just a floral ring. I bought it when it was on clearance for $29, but it's still on clearance for $29. So maybe I'm the only one that bought it. The rings that I'm wearing on this side are from Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski. So it's that Luna, uh, Luna ring and then a Brilliant Future. I think that's it for my jewelry. So the sweater that I'm wearing is from QVC. This is from Barefoot Dreams. It is soft, soft, soft and cozy. They make baby blankets and I think they make it out of the same material. So it's a long duster length. The uh, shawl is attached in the back right there so it's never going to come undone on you. It's a duster length. It's nice and long. I like that. It's got the slits on both sides. Again, I've got pockets super super nice this one is in taupe this one i bought when it was the today special value it was 79.95 that day and now it's still on the website for 87 dollars 98 and i am just uh, loving it the top that i'm wearing is a sweater that i got from target from a new day it was 17.99 i've had it on for maybe 10 hours now and as you can see it does kind of stretch out as the day goes on it is uh, thin so that even though I've got a new drawer on, it is kind of see-through, but being the only one at work today, I wasn't too worried about it. It is long sleeves. And again, it's going to be just a nice casual piece. I buy a couple of these, couple of these too. I got one in dark green, so of course that one's not going to be see-through. And I think I got one in gray too. So looking forward to wearing those. The pants that I'm wearing are from Walmart. They are the time and true. They're the boot cut jeans. Excuse the belly. It's not moving. It is not going anywhere. But these are a size two for the boot cut jeans. I do think they have a nice fit. They've got some fading right here and again in the back. They're a nice length for me. I'm wearing my Sam Edelman leopard print booties. They've got a little kitten heel on them. Um, this is the Cirrus line, which I think is uh, it's a little bit, well, quite a bit less expensive than this regular line. I got those at Macy's last winter and just loving them. So again, this is my outfit of the day. So I am excited to show you that, but I'm more excited to get into my stitch fix. So I'll be right back once I find the button. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my channel. I am so super excited to have you join me tonight to do my Stitch Fix unboxing number 23. This looks like it's going to be a really fun box and I can't wait to share it with you all. Uh, to my subscribers, thank you so much for your support and your patience. I am really slow at responding. Um, I even went into work today, Saturday. I went in for six hours again today. I'll be going in tomorrow. I am hoping to get caught up so that I can spend a couple of hours every night to work on YouTube and respond to people. So uh, thank you for your patience and I truly appreciate your support. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you click on that led, little red subscribe button right there. I would love to have you come back and join us and I hope that everyone gives this video a thumbs up. So anyway, if you are new to Stitch Fix, it is a clothing subscription. I'll leave more information in my description below. 
It will also have my link. If you use my link, you get $25 off your first fix, and I would get $25 as well. The link will take you right over to the Stitch Fix page. You fill out a quick questionnaire, you match with a stylist who will send you five items. If you buy all five items, we call that a five for five, and you get 25% discount off everything in the box. Um, you have to buy all five to get that discount, but if there's only one thing in the box or two things in the boxes, that's all you have to do is pay for that. Um, normally, if there's a styling fee on your box, you would uh, just apply that to anything that you purchase. I also have a special link that I think just about everybody has gotten this month. It's a $50 link that I can give out to one person. So if you are new to Stitch Fix and you'd like to have $50 off your first box, and who wouldn't want that? It's like a no-risk situation. I would also get $50 off. So the first one that lets me know that they want to use my link, I will send you that uh, link for $50. And in your box also, as soon as you open your box, Right on top here, it's also going to tell you everything that you need to do next. And it's also on the website if you need anything. And of course, everyone who gets Stitch Fix knows I got shoes. So I'm so excited about that. So I've got a pair of shoes. And we've got the bundle. Some people call it a burrito. I just call it a person. You're also going to get a note from your stylist. Your stylist thought these would look great on you. You are going to get your Oh Hello, which is your styling card. My nails are a mess, I know. I just got a new stash of uh, color strip nails, so I'm just, it takes me longer to figure out which one I want to use. So anyway, here is a note from my stylist. I think I read it out loud last time, so this time I will just put it here. Again, I have Jen. She talks about 25% discount, getting your fix. She's got some interesting pieces in here. It looks like she looked at my Pinterest board. So all that stuff helps your stylist to figure out. It's also going to show you a few items that are in your box and different ways that you can style it. And also on the app, on your computer, online, wherever you go, these are also stored on your page. And I believe this is my Stitch Fix number 23, and it is. So let me put this up here so you can see the items and the prices in here. So it looks like, and I knew this was an expensive box because it does have a cashmere sweater in here. So everything in my box is $383. The buy all discount would be $95.75, which is almost getting that cashmere sweater for free. And so the total would be $287.25. So if there's anything in this box that you like after you see it, those are all the item codes and the description and the prices in case you wanted to ask your stylist for them. Also inside every box, you are going to get your prepaid mailer. They are going to go through the United States Postal Service. So you can go in, drop this off, get a receipt. Receipts are always a good idea. You can, if you live in a rural area like I do, you can put it in your mailbox. Um, I can take mine to work and just to call in for my um, postal lady to come in and pick it up at work and she'll also give me a receipt. You can put it in a mail, one of those big mailboxes too. So lots of ways to get your items returned. You're gonna use that if there's something that you don't want and you're just returning it or if you need to exchange it. So for a smaller or larger size. So my stylist is Jen. I have had her from the beginning, and she has done an awesome, awesome job. She's, uh, right now, you know, I've been struggling this year, losing some weight, so my sizes are just, I don't even know what size I am. So I apologize to Jen for um, not knowing my sizes. But she is working around that and doing a great job. So anyway, she did find this awesome pair of these snake print, print sandals. And then more on the uh, brownish side, tan side. And it's got this uh, kind of cork-like wedge, wedge, so they look like they would be comfortable. It's got a buckle right here. So these look like they are going to be interesting. So these are, are they calling it gray? These are DV8. It's called the Layla or Lala Peep Toe Wedge. They're calling it gray, and it's a size 7. So it does feel like there is some cushioning right here, which I appreciate. And um, okay, and you probably saw the price already. And I don't mind paying more for shoes. 
you know, for years and years, I just went and got like famous footwear or buy one, get one or, and I'm not going to struggle with shoes that are uncomfortable. If I'm on my feet all day, I want some comfortable shoes. So there is some padding here. I think it, it's not a lot here, but I'm going to try this on and see how they, I'm, I'm loving the looks of them. So I loved it as soon as I saw the preview. So I can't wait to try these on. Alrighty, so let's get into the bundle. So first we have this black top. It is uh, Montag Montaigne. It's called the Glevin Crochet Lace Detail Knit Top. It's black. It's a size medium petite. It does have some nice crochet detail right here. As you can see, on uh, sleeveless, so around the armholes and the neckline right there. So that looks like it's going to be very pretty on. It's a nice, soft, stretchy knit. So this um, would be good if, you know, it was 40 degrees this morning when I left. But um, we're still going to have some nice days ahead of us. And again, once the winter comes or the fall comes, it's going to be a great layering piece. So anyway, loving the looks of this. I think this is going to be very, very pretty on. Next is this cashmere sweater. So this is a PLY cashmere. It's size medium. So I'm going to see if there's another description. It probably is. Uh, it's called the... Cervena Leopard Print Cashmere Pullover, brown, size medium. So again, it's a nice leopard print that I really love. It's a nice soft cashmere. It's got just a nice rounded neckline. It's got the long sleeves, some ribbing detail right there. Looks like just a slight rounded hemline. So this looks like it should be a fun print to wear. Next we have this, this is heavy. This is a cardigan and it's a Stitch Fix exclusive. Can't find much detail on it. Okay, here we go. So this is Evolution. It's a size medium petite and it's got like a waterfall type um, interesting right here so it's got like this layered look that so maybe they call that the waterfall where it just kind of drapes different it's got some different shapes on it so we've got uh, like some geometric fronts right here some stripes and then a white border all the way around so this looks like this could be interesting and it's very heavy so this is going to be a nice and warm staple this winter and then lastly, we have a pair of Vigos jeans. And these are the Sean Bootcut Jean. This indigo in a size 4. So we've got regular pockets in the back. We've got working pockets in the front. A little bit of whiskering right there. Some regular pockets in the back. And again, just some faded detail. And nice little flare. So nice, nice getting back into the, the boot cut jeans. So anyway, got some awesome items. I've been dying since I saw the preview to try these on. So we will be right back and we'll uh, hopefully everything fits. And I can't wait to hear your comments. All right, so we are back with the first item. And this is the ply cashmere. It's the Savannah Leopard Print Cashmere Top. In brown, it's a size medium, it's $98. And it is 100% cashmere, so it is dry clean only. So I do the positives first. So I do like this neckline. It's a scoop neckline right here, well, just a rounded neckline. It's got the ribbing detail right here, the extra stitching, and then the stitching right here. So it, it gives it like that casual vibe. So that's pretty cool. Uh, sleeves on me go pretty long, but that's fine because you can just roll it up. It's cuffed, it's gonna stay or you could roll it up and show up in a bracelet if you had a bracelet on, so that's no biggie. I think it does fit good in, in here. I don't know if maybe it is big here, but I think the fit is okay. What's got me messed up here is this, it just seems like there's all this extra material right here in the front. The back looks fine. It's, I like the scoop, it's rounded, and then it goes up right here. So I think that does give it a nice look, a nice casual look. 
And maybe this is the one that you're supposed to front tuck. And I've never front tucked before, well, because I've been able to fit my pants, hands down my pants to do this, which is probably a good thing in public, right? So, I don't know. If I could manage to do a front tuck, does that make it look better right in there? And then just have it go down, because I do like the rounded on the back side. So let me know your thoughts on this. It's $98, but of course, if it's a buy all, this is basically for free. But I don't know if, you know, for $98 for a sweater, I want to look at it and say, oh my God, this is beautiful. I love it. I want to wear it all the time. I don't want to take it off. And I think this is what's throwing me off. And I don't know if a uh, small would fit or if it's just the style. And maybe it's not for me. So anyway. Let me know your thoughts on that because I could really use some help and some point it. So I will be right back. All right, so I am back with the last four items. So anyway, this is the sweater and I'm just going to go over the, the details, the names of the sweater and the prices of everything in my recap. So this is the look of the sweater. It's a medium petite. So it is a good length. That's again, so a couple inches above the knee. Got a nice pattern again. It is soft. It's cozy. It's heavy. This one is going to keep somebody warm. It's got this cascading type front. There's no buttons or anything. It's just meant to hang open and to have that nice casual vibe. So maybe you just kind of go like this, let it fall. There aren't any pockets, but that's okay. All right, so there's the cardigan. And again, we'll go over the names and things on the recap just to save a little bit of time you can see on the sleeve you got that detail with the geometric pattern as well so it is very very cute this top i love this top it's got this crochet detail right here along the neckline it's a nice scoop neck so you can wear a nice necklace if you wanted it's a petite petite medium petite so i don't have bat wings it goes nice under the arms it's a nice fit there's nothing showing it's a nice length. Loving this. I am going to get a lot of use out of this as a layering piece uh, where it, when it's nice out without a sweater or anything. Just loving this. These are the Vygos jeans. And I think in a note she said these are a 32. She thought maybe they might be too long for me. The shoes that I have on, I've got on the uh, snake print uh, wedges. They're about a one and a half inch to two inch heel. So I would probably need to wear my three inch heels if I were to keep these. These have some extra material, uh, again, right in here. But again, they are a four. And so they're, they're big on me. So I would have to size down to a two on these. I do like the fit. They've got a little bit of fading right here. Again, the pockets are a little lower than I would like, but I don't think I've been found pants lately. Some nice fading detail right here to make them look worn. Loving the uh, boot cut pants so these I think are a keeper I think if I size down I don't know if I want to go to a two and keep that 32 inch and seam or should I go see what else they have maybe a 30 would be better for me so anyway see if I can get down to the shoes and again I did put some knee highs on because if I go to a store and try on shoes I don't try them on barefoot so they do have uh, padding under the ball of the foot. So that's one thing I look for is padding at the heel and padding under the ball of the foot. So they do have some, some nice padding there. It's not a lot, but it should be nice. I love the wedge detail. I think these are gonna be cute summertime shoes, maybe a little bit into the fall. They do have the buckle, which sometimes it's a pain in the neck to bend over at the end of the day to get them off. Um, you know, like my earth, a lot of the earth shoes have that Velcro um, or a zipper that I, I like that kind of detail to get in and out quicker. But, um, you know, right now they do seem comfortable. I haven't, I mean, I just put them on a few minutes ago. So I think I might want to try them on because it does feel tight right there under that big toe. But they are really cute. So I will show them again at the, uh, the recap and I'll be right back. 
hi everyone and welcome back for the recap so thank you so much for watching so far and i hope you're ready to leave me some comments i think i've made up my mind but i am always um, touched by your comments and that really helps me make my final decisions first up we have the dv8 the layla peep toe wedge these are 85 dollars. i think they are stinking adorable i love the cork wedge right here i think that makes it nice for summertime there is so much material right here i think it's going to be a good fall transition set not a saddle but a sandal um love the stank print they're calling this gray it's a size 7 for 85 dollars okay so we did have padding here and under the ball of the feet that i love but it was tight right in here for me and because i don't think it's real leather i don't think this is going to uh, get softened up and get a little more comfortable over time the only other thing that i wasn't thrilled with was the buckle on the side and just um i just think i've gotten spoiled with some of my other shoes that either have velcro wrap right there or especially the zippers to get in and out quicker um, so for that reason i think i'm going to pass it for the comfort level here and because of the buckle but i think these are stinking adorable if you like that style i think you need to ask for it because i think you're going to love them Next, we have the open front cardigan. This is the Evolution by Cyrus. It's the Chiana Graphic Open Cardigan Off-White. It's a medium petite for $88. Love this sweater. Love the pattern, the geometric print on the sweater. It's on the sleeve detail. It's on the back. It's on the front. Love the way this cascades. So you just kind of put it on and then just kind of plop it down where it falls. Um, material is so so soft it's a nice thick weight this is going to keep somebody warm in the winter i think it's a really cute cardigan but for me because it's not going to be a five for five i need to kind of be a little bit pickier about what i keep so for that reason i think this is going to go back but it is adorable love it next we have what turned out to be my favorite item in the whole box and this is the Bantad. Montagna Glaren Crochet Lace Detail Knit Top in Black. It's a medium petite for $44. Love this crochet detail along the neckline and right here along the armhole. It is sleeveless. And look, Ma, I had no bat wings, so I was really happy with that. Um, it's a nice, soft, stretch, stretchy jersey material. I think I'm going to get a, a lot of use out of this, whether it's a nice hot day or going into fall or winter, it's going to be a really nice layering piece over under a cardigan or a blazer. Next, we have the Vagos jeans. Love the style of these bootcut jeans. These are called the Sean bootcut jean. These are indigo, they're a size four. Love the whiskering detail. I love the uh, faded, like the warm look right here on the thighs, and I especially like the bootcut. It's a nice wide bootcut. I'm gonna love these, they're a 32 inch inseam. I do have to size down to a two on these, so I'm crossing my fingers that I can get online and uh, after I read some comments, and hopefully they have a size two available. Love these jeans. They are super, super comfortable. Next, we have what I thought was going to be my favorite item in the box, and it's this 100% cashmere sweater. It's uh, from Ply Cashmere. It's the Sivana Leopard Print Cashmere in brown. It's a size medium. This is $98, and for 100% cashmere, I think it's totally worth it. It's nice and soft. I love the ribbing detail uh, around this crew neckline right here. I love the stitching detail right here on there, and again around here. That same detail is around the, uh, the ribbed cuff. I think it gives it a nice casual vibe, kind of like a sweatshirt. I like the fact that it was was rounded on the hemline for the front and back. I think the back probably looked better than the front on me. And again, it was rounded, so it goes up at the hip line. So loving the style on this, I think it was really nice. On me, I don't think it was flattering. I think right in here, it just had a little too much fabric for what I would be comfortable wearing. And if I'm going to spend $98 on a nice cashmere sweater, I want to look in the mirror and say, oh my God, I love this on me. I have never taken it off. I'm going to wear it every day. And for me, I just didn't get that because of that fit. And I'm not one to tuck in. And I don't know if sizing down to a small would fit that. But so for now, I'm going to pass on this. But again, I am loving this cashmere sweater. And I am open to receiving more in the future, Jen. 
So again, I think my stylist, Jen, did a fantastic job. She's looked at my Pinterest. She's read my request. And I think she's done a fabulous job. So I am really happy with this fix. I'm only thinking about keeping two things. But I would love to hear your comments. And thanks again for watching, everyone. I hope everyone gives this uh, video a thumbs up. And I hope to chat again soon. Okay, bye-bye, everyone. Have a great weekend.